What's up, y'all? It's Misha from the Spa Blueprint, and today we're talking about Canva. Canva has a new copywriting AI tool, AI, artificial intelligence, okay? And this AI tool is here to stay, is not here to play, all right? So basically, the AI tool helps you with writer's block. So it helps you write blogs for your business, um, content creation, um, captions, Ad copies if you want to make ads, um, pamphlets, brochures, um, emails to your clients. There's so many things you need help with when it comes to writing and coming up with ideas. And a lot of times you want to focus on business and service and doing good in your business. You don't want to focus so much on creating content all the time because you got to think of ideas constantly. And this will help with that, especially since Canva Pro is only $12.99 and this, um, this magic right AI tool, they let you use it 25 times before you have to get Canva Pro. So use it for 25 times for free, for free. So I think that is so dope. So I'm gonna let y'all see how I access it and I want you guys to play around with it and let me know what you guys think about it. So I'm on the Canva homepage and what you're gonna do is click on Docs. Okay, when you click on Docs, you're going to see Doc and Docs to Dex. You're going to click on the Doc. Okay, we're going to wait for this page to load so it can load up Doc and Magic Write. Shouldn't take too much longer. Let's see if Spectrum is on point today. <laughs> All right, so we are in there. So it's a plus sign. Sometimes the plus sign isn't there. That's how you access the magic right. So if it's not a plus sign here, if for some reason when this page loads and you don't see a plus sign, what you're gonna do is just press shift in the plus sign. You know, the plus sign is, where is the plus sign as a matter of fact? The plus sign is right next to the backspace key on the keyboard. So that's all you're gonna do. So if you don't see it, just press the plus sign on the keyboard, shift plus sign. So now that I press the plus sign, I'm gonna press magic right. Okay, we're here. See, it already tells me you have 22 magic rights left. I'm not in my account with Canva Pro. This is a free account. So this is how you guys are gonna look at it. This is free, not on Canva Pro. So I'm gonna say write a blog on, let's say, how to start a massage business. <laughs> how about that? Enter. Let's see what Magic Right come up with. Hmm. It's loading pretty slow today. Okay. Now, how fast was that? Do y'all see that? Did it just came up with that? That just saved me so much time. Now, the only thing you have to do after this, once you get the blog and it writes it for you, you have to go to a plagiarism checker site. So type on Google plagiarism checker just to make sure and verify that there's not too much information in your blog that is being plagiarized okay that someone else has wrote about and you know at that point you're plagiarizing someone's content and we don't want that okay for the most part the ar i said ar the ai tools are about 95 percent accurate okay they much more accurate than we are so but you still always want to double check so this is a blog. I only thing I would do is just add my own style to it. Just, you know, add the meat and potatoes in the middle, you know, give it a little love in the middle of the blog so it can be a little bit longer. But this will help you so much with just captions. And um, if you want to make a, a reel on Instagram or something, you need to come up with some content. Use this tool. Use Canva Pro, $12.99 a month. Use all the little tools. Use it to make some money. Like Canva Pro is 
that girl like camper pro is it <laughs> so um we're going to end the video right here i just wanted to let you guys know that there is a new tool out it's a new ai tool on canva and it's very inexpensive compared to a lot of other ones out there i know they're the main website the ai tool that everybody is on is free for the most part but a lot of people don't know how to access that so canva pro is very simple it's very easy to access so that's it you guys um if you've used this before let me know what you think about it do you think it's good for content creation um if you use any other ai tools let me know in the comments let me know what y'all think and i will catch y'all in the next video peace